Hey there, it's Dave Altavilla for Hot Hardware, and this is Microsoft's new Surface 2 10.6-inch Windows 8.1 RT tablet with its companion key cover. Surface 2 was recently made available at retail for $449, which includes its 24-watt AC power pack with 5-pin magnetic connector that just snaps into the edge of the tablet like so. And it also has a nice LED-lit accent to let you know it's plugged in and charging the device. Let's take a look around Microsoft's new Surface 2 10-inch tablet. Microsoft's Surface 2 is powered by a quad-core NVIDIA Tegra 4 system on a chip with a 72-core NVIDIA GeForce graphics engine on board. That's paired to 2 gig of RAM and either 32 or 64 gig of storage, depending on model. Surface 2 also has 802.11bgn wireless connectivity on board, as well as Bluetooth 4, USB 3, an ambient light sensor, an accelerometer with a gyroscope and compass. Its display is a 10.6 inch clear type full HD panel and although it's glossy, it is gorgeous with full 1920 by 1080p resolution, excellent viewing angles and great brightness. Surface 2 also has two cameras on board, an updated 3.5 megapixel front facing camera that's well integrated with Microsoft's Skype uh, service for video chat and it's a standard rear facing 5 megapixel HD camera for photos and video recording. On the bottom edge is where the Surface 2's magnetic type cover connector is. On the left edge you'll find a magnetic power connector, a USB 3 port, mini display port, and a speaker port. On the right edge you can see there's a little indentation in the body of the device that lets you pull the Surface 2's kickstand out more easily. And there's a volume rocker here as well as a 2-in-1 audio jack and another speaker port. On the top right edge you'll find the screen lock slash power button. The Surface 2's kickstand has two positions now, one that's more upright and then there's this nearly full 90 degree angle open position for better positioning on your lap or perhaps if you're standing over the tablet with the tablet at table height and you need to angle its screen up a little bit more towards you. Incidentally, the Surface 2 is still heftier than most 10 inch tablets in the market, weighing in at a pound and a half and nearly 5 inches thick, 0.4 inches thick to be exact. But for us, its premium build quality is worth a little bit of extra weight. And one last thing, there's a micro SD card slot hiding here behind the kickstand, in case you missed this rather important expansion feature. We almost did. The Surface 2's new type cover is super thin and built with a sort of brushed suede material that's very comfortable and feels high quality for such a thin design. The type cover snaps easily into the Surface 2 and literally gets pulled into proper position by its strong magnetic force and a rather satisfying click. Typing on the cover was actually a lot more comfortable than we expected with a fair amount of key travel for such a thin device and a comfortable layout that combined with its responsiveness, was fairly easy to get used to. In terms of bundled software, Microsoft includes Skype and Office 2013 RT. Office 2013 has the usual, as you would expect, Word, PowerPoint, Excel, etc. And you can uh, obviously use files from either your desktop or notebook with Surface 2 as well. Uh, Microsoft's store is actually coming along nicely now as well and there's a good assortment of apps, utilities, and games at your disposal from mainstream apps like Netflix, Twitter, Kindle, Shazam, Hulu Plus, Box, and Urban Spoon to more recent additions like Adobe Photoshop Express, Instagram Explore, and Fresh Paint. Fresh Paint is a free Microsoft app that replaces Windows Paint and it has some nice features like different brush types and a color sampling wheel. I'm not exactly the best painter and I had a tough time with staying in the lines but Fresh Paint is actually a refreshing, pun intended, evolution beyond paint and it's more than just a simple update. With Surface 2 you also get 200 gigs, that's a lot of storage, 
of free SkyDrive storage for two years for syncing your files and data to the cloud, as well as unlimited Skype landline calling in the U.S. and Skype Wi-Fi at available hotspots for one year. Camera performance with the Surface 2 is a bit of a mixed bag. The camera app is about as bare bones as you get, with a few simple controls for exposure, a timer, and panorama shots. Image quality with the 5 megapixel rear facing camera is lackluster at best, with a bit of shutter lag, meager low light performance, and muted colors. However, the 3.5 megapixel wide aperture front facing webcam, on the other hand, does a bang up job of delivering good image quality under low light conditions, which can really help with Skype calls in less than optimal settings. The still image I've taken here is with the lights completely off in my office, though the lights in the adjacent room behind me were still on. Impressive, actually. And so to kick back a little bit, we pulled down this fun third-person shooter from NVIDIA's Tegra Zone app. It's the uh, free trial of Judge Dredd vs. Zombies. Uh, the graphics were pretty solid, and even touch controls on glass were manageable and playable as well. The game was actually pretty fun, and why not? Now, tis the season for slaying zombies anyways. In terms of general performance, Surface 2 feels really snappy, fluid, and responsive, especially when multitasking, and that's in part courtesy of NVIDIA's Tegra 4 quad-core system on a chip. And in the benchmarks, Surface 2 scores top marks, and our sample, specifically with the latest firmware and driver updates, actually surpassed Samsung's Galaxy Note 10.1 2014 and the Galaxy Note 3, though it did fall just short of Apple's iPhone 5S. In terms of battery life, we're still digging into the metrics there, but with an estimated 10 hours of video playback, according to what Microsoft specifies, we think that's probably going to be conservative. We may see better performance and battery life. All told, we really like Microsoft's new Surface 2, and with a continually maturing Microsoft Store, as well as a full suite of MS Office apps, SkyDrive storage, and Skype as part of the bundle for $449, we think Microsoft's new Surface 2 Windows 8.1 RT slate is definitely worth your consideration. Make sure you stop by Hot Hardware for all the details and benchmarks. I'm Dave Altavilla with the Microsoft Surface 2. Thanks for stopping by.